Oh my god, the video is starting. I gotta clean this shit. It's like, it's dirty as fuck. I really gotta take better care of my stuff, to be honest with you. Oh, fuck. Welcome back to another video. It is your boy, Emil, or Oatmeal, or Emily, or Amelia, as my bullies used to call me. In case you can't read or for whatever reason your eyes don't work, I sincerely apologize for that. But today's video, we're gonna, we're gonna prank call some condom companies. We're gonna, we're gonna fuck with some people today, guys. You fucking virgin, you know what a condom is, dude. That's pretty hurtful. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't realize we were hurting feelings today, but, uh, but okay. I've been wanting to do one of these for like a very, very, very long time now. Uh, so, Without further ado, let's get into it. So basically what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna call the condom company and I'm gonna tell them that their magnums can't fit me anymore and I wanna know if they have any bigger sizes. Just to give you a little bit of heads up. I'm Steven. Hi, how are you? Good. Um, I just had a question. Uh, -huh. uh my name is Applejack, but my boys just call me Jack. Um, I was wondering uh, about the condoms. So, uh, my girl came over the other night and we were going at it pretty heavy and uh, I tried to put one of the magnums on, but they couldn't fit me. So I was wondering if you guys have any, like, bigger sizes or anything, you know? Yeah, we have, uh, what's called, uh, Mega Big Boy XL. It's made by Beyond 7. That's gonna be the biggest one we carry. Oh, a, a Mega Boy, eh? Yeah, it's called Mega Big Boy Double XL. Oh, okay, okay, okay. And that's for, like, any size, or...? Okay, okay, okay. Where, where can I find those? Do you guys have, like, an online thing I could check out, maybe? Yeah, if you just go to condomdepot.com and you just look at all of our... We actually have a whole section for larger size condoms. You just go ahead and click that category. Mm -hmm. You'll be able to see that one and all the yeah. other ones we have. Because uh, I'm going to be honest with you, man. Like, I'm usually a raw type of guy, but the way these girls run around nowadays, I'm just kind of just trying to keep it strapped, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah. But, um, but I appreciate it, though. You said Condom Depot. Is that what you said? Yes, sir. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Uh, what's your name? Can I use you as a reference, possibly? Or maybe get like a 10% yeah, off or something? There's, there's no place to put a reference. Okay, no reference. America, am I right? But, um, uh, all right, I guess I'll uh, catch you later. I appreciate it, though. Thank you, man. Well, yeah. Yes, sir. You have a good day. All right, hey, have a better one. Oh, this guy was not having it. Oh, my God. You could tell he was low-key kind of pissed off. Like, what the fuck is this guy talking about? And what's up with a mega boy? What the fuck? I've never heard of a condom called Mega Boy. I'm gonna look that up. Bro, this guy wasn't fucking lying. It turns out like it's a, like, it's actually a real thing. Like the Mega Boy, like, I don't know if you could see that, wait till it focus. You could see that shit, like it's, it's real. A Mega Big Boy, hold up. No fucking way. Yeah, I don't think I could fit any of these, dude. Okay, I'm gonna be honest with you. That first prank call, that was a little bit weak. I feel like I can, I can do way better than that. All right, I didn't, I didn't push, I didn't push the boundary enough. All right, so I'm gonna call another company, and I'm gonna say, what am I gonna say? Uh, okay, I'm gonna say, uh, the condom broke on me while I was having fucking sex. Me and my girlfriend kind of got into it, and uh, I, I put on one of the condoms, and it ended up breaking on me. And, you know, didn't see that coming, you know, <laughs> coming. But, um, the condoms, they had, yeah, they ended up breaking on me. And then, you know, now, like, she's telling me that she's pregnant and uh, I don't know what to do. Like, I can't afford, like, another, I can't afford a kid on the way, you know what I mean? Yeah, uh, well, this, this wouldn't be the number uh, for consumers. Okay. Okay. Yeah. 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 I mean. Okay. I mean, in your, you know, while I have you here, in your personal opinion, like, what do you think I should do? Cause I was thinking about, like, I don't know, like. Part of me. I mean, I think you should be a hundred percent sure before. Um, yeah. Yeah, because that was, that was my original concern. But, um, like, I was wondering, like, do you know if my uh, health insurance would cover, like, an abortion or would I have to pay for that out of pocket? Probably not. Mm -hmm. I, you would have to check with your insurance provider. Okay. Uh, and, but, I mean, definitely not yours, maybe hers. 
okay, okay, okay. Or maybe go like like a, a free clinic or something, you know, Planned Parenthood, you know what I mean? Um, yeah, they don't, they don't perform those services. Oh, they don't? Um, they might so what are they, so what are they for then? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. You know. Because they're kind of dropping the ball, like marketing wise. Like that could be a good market for doing that kind of stuff. You know. I'm sorry. No, I'm saying like you know they would probably make like a lot more profits if they actually did perform those. You know what they do. You know what I mean? Yeah, I don't. I don't know that they're even equipped. Um, yeah. 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 Get some fucking doctors on the way. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Malfunctioning. Wanted to have them, but you may be able to have them replace the product. Yeah. Um, as far as your girlfriend, I would say definitely make sure. Mm hmm. Be positive. Oh, she's not, she's not, yeah, yeah. Uh, she's not really my girlfriend, to be honest with you. Um, but to be honest with you. Part. What'd you say? Nothing. Nothing. Oh, what'd you say? What, what was, you know, it's not my problem, you know what I mean? Nah, but, um. Yeah, yeah. Honestly, I it to be honest with you, it's kind of my fault because I was I was actually supposed to get a vasectomy, but you know my dumb self ended up not missing the like I missed the appointment and I I didn't even know why I didn't go, you know. So that's kind of on me, you know. Uh, I'm 20 right now. 20, 20. Yeah. Why is that bad? How, wait, how old are you, eh? <laughs> What's going on? Yeah, I understand. You know, I just don't want to deal with the whole, you know, kids running around, you know, always wanting to do homework and shit. You know, like, who has time for that, you know? Yeah, I know, I don't. Yeah. Wait, how old are you? Um, old enough to be your mother. Oh, really? Wow. So, uh, wow. So, we're talking MILF, huh? Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say call the editorial number as far as the product and um, make uh, sure the test results with your non-girlfriend and... Okay. Thanks a lot, I appreciate it. You really helped me out here. She really hung up on me. If you watch the video, I appreciate the fuck out of you for sitting there and watching my dumbass perform prank calls. But um, seriously, thank you so much. And uh, I don't know, I wanna do more prank calls, but I'm not 100% sure what I wanna do. But the condom thing, I think, was it's a pretty funny concept. I'm definitely gonna have to try that again. But uh, thank you, and... Uh, God, I gotta, I gotta start planning outros. Like I don't, I don't know what to do right now. Anyway, catch you guys later. Peace. Yeah. Nah, that was weak.